After the literature section, Miss Smith started to tidy up the fictional novel section, which had 156 books. To make the library more visually attractive, she picked another type of bookcase to hold the books. This bookcase can hold 12 books. Again, Abigail helped her calculate the number of bookcases to buy. Occasionally, she reflected on the area model she used to calculate the number of books the library used to have before. Maybe I can make use of it oppositely in the division, she wondered. Do you still remember the area model we used in multiplication? We do a similar operation in the division. We find the quotient step by step from tens to ones. We should first find the tens of the quotient of 156 divided by 12, which is 1. 1 ten times 12 equals 120, and we write it below, 156. We subtract 120 from 156, and we got the remainder 36. Then. We write it below 120 and in the next block. After that, we make the division 36 divided by 12 to find the ones of the quotient. This simple calculation gives 3, and 36 minus 36 equals 0. By grouping the expansion form of the quotient, we know the quotient is 13. Miss Smith should buy 13 bookcases for the fiction novel section. Hey guys, have you found the correct number?